Alright everyone, welcome back to Let's Play Until Dawn. Uh, you know what? Maybe there's a better spot. Does this spot start with a G? There are lots of places out here. I already started clearing this off for us. Like a gentleman. Oh, come on, let's look around. Is that maybe how he messes up his finger? So maybe there's a blade anyway. under it? It's just my undies. The lacy ones. Well, hell, we don't need those. You don't want me to model them for you? I'm just gonna rip them off anyways. Maybe I want to show them off. Puts me in a generous mood. Let's go get them. He says, I don't remember taking this path before. Then that light. Okay. Thought it was flickering. But, well, I can see something down here for sure. Uh. Do I want to drop down? Or do I want to go up here? Sexy kisser on this thing. Dare to put your hand in it. Day, hey, I wouldn't. Just slide it up in there. No. Ah! <gasps> Crap. M. Oh, right. Nice one. <laughs> Too easy. That's me. Mr. Easy. Oh, come on. What was that? Uh, I'm not sure. Probably just an animal. Not like. Definitely don't sound good. So what, now do I drop down? Madam. Thank you. Oh my, very impressive. You didn't even do anything. What do you mean very impressive? Okay, this looks familiar. But I don't know if it was with him. I've been here before, though. What the hell is that? Note. Welcome back. Whoa. Uh. That's gotta be Chris. Or Josh. They're just trying to mess with us. Kind of uncool, guys. I don't like this. Me neither. Oh! Matt! What the hell's going on? All because you wanted to stupid on me. It's time no, to get out of here. I'm kind of not giving a shit about my panties anymore. I kind of just want to split. Agree. Smart. This was a little bit smart about something. And this guy's back. I'd like to understand your feelings toward people of fear, isolation, loneliness. Do you share this fear? Uh, I guess. Is that so? Because that's uh. not reflected in the way you are playing your game now, is it? What? Oh, God. Okay, sorry about that pause, the dog. So, I'm trying not to have it be, you know, too much of a distraction. And now 
Now, let us investigate your feelings toward other people in greater depth. What you value, what you respect in yourself and others. Which would you say was most important in a person, loyalty or honesty? So you would tell a lie in order to be loyal to a friend, okay. And what about loyalty versus charity? What? So you would sooner look after your friends before caring for those in greater need? Well, once again, I'm afraid we're out of time. That one was short. We'll talk again soon. Previous on Until Dawn. It was just a prank, Han. Today is the one year anniversary of the dreadful tragedy of Hannah and Beth Washington, the twins who are still missing. I know it would mean so much to Hannah and Beth that we're, we're all still here together. And I'm thinking of them. So yeah, it was him in the video. Whoa, hello. Somebody's getting a little friendly. Boom. Butterfly effect. Excuse me? Did you say something? Oh, did you not hear me with your sluttiness? Stop it! Mike, why don't you check out the guest cabin, the one I told you about? Yeah. Yeah, all right. Did you hear that? What in God's name are you wearing? Here's our one-way ticket to the spirit realm. But watch out for that, Josh. He's a schemer. Well, that's how it's gonna be. Yes? Yes! So, it says here, to communicate the spirit world, you must free your mind of all preconceptions, drop all inhibitions, and generally give yourself over entirely to the will of others, sublimating your every desire to the whims of the spirit master, which is me. It doesn't say that. And all present will remove their garments at my sole discretion. Chris, come on, this is serious. <laughs> oh, I'm deadly serious. <laughs> oh, shush it. Let's try this. Yes, please. Okay, then. Let's see what happens. Ashley, since you're a recent convert, why don't you be our medium for today? Okay. Um... Is anyone there? Will you reveal yourself to us if you're there? <laughs> Wait a minute, did you do that? I didn't do anything. It's moving again. <laughs> H? What's it spelling? Hold on. How's this happening? Are you moving it? I swear, it's just moving. Oh, shit. Help? How are we supposed to help? I don't know, what does it mean? We need to know who it is if we're supposed to help them. Who are you? Oh, oh here it goes. Okay, S. I. S. T. E. R. Sister. Sister? Whose sister? Oh, come on, is this for real? Shut up. Ask it whose sister. Josh, it's, it's gotta be. Yeah, okay, well. Which sister is it then? Ashley, ask who it is. It's probably Beth because it's a smaller name. Who are we speaking to? Hannah? Is that you? Oh, God. <laughs> this is messed up. Josh? Are you? I'm fine. Are you sure? Because we can stop. No. Dude, it's cool. I want to hear what it says. I don't know where to start. Think about it. If this is actually Hannah, I mean, we can find out what happened that night. Josh? I can handle it. Okay. Um, let me think. <clears throat> We miss you, and we want to know what happened to you. Can you, can you tell us?
tell us what happened? B? E? T? R? Uh-oh. I don't like this. Betrayed. What does she mean? Oh, it, it's still going. Oh, God. K? I? L? L? E? D? No! Kill. We didn't kill them. It was just a prank. A Ash, calm, calm down, OK? Just we need to find out more. I'm sorry. I am guys, so guys, sorry. What, what, what do they mean? Ask them what, what happened. It's, it's, the, it's the only way to know. Ask them, Ash. OK. Who killed you? Hannah, who was it? L? I? B? The library. Maybe there's something in the library e? here? R, O, O. Proof. There, there's, there's proof. In the library. Oh, no. ah! <sighs> Holy shit, Chris. You know what? No, this is bullshit. This isn't real. Josh, I don't know what's going on. Listen, I don't know. I don't know if you think messing with me is somehow going to help me deal with my grief or whatever, but this is not cool. Josh, no! You wanted to use the spirit board! Hey, hey calm down. It's, it's not actually. I don't need fault. this right now, okay? You guys are full of it. Should we go after him? Ah, man, I, I mean, he'll be okay. Let's, let's just give him some time. I don't blame him. That was crazy. The pointer flew right off the table. I mean, if you're faking it, if you were doing one hell of a job. I wasn't faking anything. I think we should do what it says. We should look in the library. Yes? Okay, so now I can see what happened to her. Yes. Oh. Sure, she's just faking it. If not, I'll be pretty surprised. For one, her footprints end. Yes. Where did you go? This is not funny. Jess. Buddy, you in there? Ah! Whoa! Christ! You scared the blue out of my jeans. What the hell is that doing in there anyway? What is it? How did just a mask like that don't fly up like that? It doesn't make any sense. I totally promise I won't murder you when I find you. Oh! Oh my, oh my god! No. <laughs> that was so good! Not, no! <laughs> wait, 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 you had to see those. Had to I'm not see seeing that. No! No! no. no. <laughs> Recorded that? <laughs> Look at your face! <laughs> I was scared, Jed. You can't just jump out at somebody. I'm in the middle of the woods. It's scary. I'm sorry, I didn't I, scare you. If you send that to anybody, I'm you're what? gonna kill you. I didn't know you had such a cute little lady like scream, Michael. <laughs> Guess you never really know someone until you've scared the pants off of them. <laughs> As far as I can tell, my pants are still on. Oh, is that so? Yeah. Looks like you have to try harder. A challenge, eh? Well, I hope you're strapped in, because you're about to feel the full force of my mind-melting thrill skills. That dude, he's watching us from over there somewhere. And then we got another totem. I have no idea what that was even showing me exactly. Wow. This cabin is so far away, like holy crap. Hey girl, you know how to do it. 
Why would the guest cabin be so far away? Light over there. So why can we have like no lights here? No. Hello. Someone there? Whatever it was, what was it? Deer? Is that finally the cabin? It's everything you described, Michael. Wait, what? The cabin. I love it. Yeah. This isn't really it, is it? I would so hope not. We're not getting no revenge. Hey, check out this mask. No, why? It's so weird, right? It creeps me out. How do you like it? Oh my god. Oh, Mike, stop! Huh? You're lost. Was there anything else in here? So no, the mask is it. I mean, I don't think anything bad probably would have happened if I would have scared her. But I don't see what would have. I mean, she might like punch him or something. Animals in this place, man. Sounds like it's getting killed by something. I'm pretty sure it got killed. Taking no risks. On, we gotta go. I am. <sighs> Mike, get the key, get it open. <gasps> Like, they have to be facing spirits. Had it under control. Hold on. Oh, bullshit. No, 100%. 100%. 110. 
Like that sound it's making. Holy crap, I feel like I just ran a marathon. I think we kind of did. Was it a bear? Yeah, gotta be. Things are crazy fast. I mean, I didn't see it. Hey, things not gonna come barging in, I promise. How can you be sure? Because I'm pretty sure bears don't know how to open cabin doors. Nobody knows how to I've take them, them down. Car doors. What? Where? On the internet. Really? Okay, well, this isn't the internet, Jess. Right? This is real life. And I promise you that no bear or anything else is gonna open that cabin door. I guess you're right. Okay. I'm almost feeling relaxed again. Almost. And now she's not. Typical. Urgh. This is not the cozy chalet I was promised, Mike. Yeah, it's a drive through something, right? Well, there is a fireplace. Well, we don't need a fire to heat things up. Michael, I am a lady, and a lady needs a proper romantic setting. Okay. A lady would like to cuddle up with her man by a nice cozy fire bathed in atmospheric mood lighting. Right. It'll get plenty toasty once we're rubbing up against each other. Mike. Yeah. Fire and mood lighting. Yes. Ah, well, this will take care of the mood lighting. There's probably no wood in there. Some right here. I can't see. It's so dark. All right. Logs are ready to go. Just need a match. That of which I don't have. Right here. Okay. Looks like we weren't the only ones to meet the friendly neighborhood terror bears. That does not make me feel any better. Well, at least I got a clue. What's this? Oh, Jess. Look at this. Is it a fire? No. Way cooler. Guns make men go completely bonkers. Nothing. <laughs> He's so stupid. Right. I shall never understand what we have together. The matches I think I see on my ground. She dropped her phone. Sherlock. Can't find it? Crap, no. Oh, boy. I must have dropped it outside. Oh. Shit. I can't lose my phone. My parents will kill me. You can always get a new one. That's like my fourth one this year. Okay. Okay. Well, I'll have to... Like, how old are you? It's gotta be outside. Yeah, I don't think we want to go out there right now with the bear or whatever it is. <sighs> Fine. No, the matches were right there. Looky, looky. Who's gonna fire up some nookie? You've been dying to use that line since we got here, haven't you? Hold up. Huh? Nice. This will lighten up the mood a little. Oh, so we actually can have power. <laughs> Nope. Hey, what, are you okay? What are you doing? It's, it's the lights. I know it's the lights, dummy. You broke them. 
Uh, it's probably faulty wiring or something. Uh, you've got faulty wiring. Man one, fire zero. Very nice. Bravo. All right, my lady. What comes next? She already forgot about her phone, apparently. <laughs> Got the horny dude outside peeking in. Should he know? No. Okay, well, go find out now, please. Because you know it's so nice not being able to see. What is that noise? The window broke. Her phone. He threw it through the window. It's your phone. What? How is it my phone? I don't know. It just came through the window. Because that makes oh, sense. Fuck! Say, goddamn it! What? Those goddamn assholes probably followed us out here to fuck with us, and just when we were getting down to business. <sighs> Guess that just happened. Do you really think the girls were communicating with us? I don't know. I don't know if I wish they were, or if I wish they weren't. I guess we should find out. Alright, I'm gonna stop this part right here. So thanks for watching. Be sure to like the video and subscribe so you know when I upload the next part.